Hi, it's Alicia coming at you straight from Alicia Bag Studio here in downtown Charleston. And this is today's sample bag. This is one of the original bags from the collection we first launched many moons ago. It is eggplant, which was the most popular color of that collection. This was my bag and certainly has some wear on it, but I'm excited to give you a tour. This bag outsold the other bags, the green, which was Kelly Green, named after my friend Kelly, and the saddle, um, two to one at one point. It also has a purple interior. It is not quite eggplant, it's most definitely a purple. If we take this Sharpie here, you can see it looks really bright against the leather, but not as bright against the interior. There is a rip right here. It's very slight, but it is there. This bag opens with the leather strap and it is Velcro, unlike some of our other newer models, which are not. It will fit up to a 15 inch laptop. Here's the 15 inch with a case on it and that will fit right in here like this. It's a tight squeeze, but it's meant to hold that and it does just like so. This has our signature clam shell opening, just like our current bags. And this zipper, um, despite not being quite as good as these new zippers, which you can see slide extremely easily back and forth. This is the indigo compared to the eggplant. Um, it does work well because I've used it a lot. This zipper has the Alicia bags all written out, which kind of, <laughs> it reminds me very much of this first collection because it's the only time we did that. Here are the interior pockets. You can see it's got the brass nameplate here that also says Alicia Bags, the same as the zipper. And these pockets in here are also lined in the grain and in the eggplant leather. These pockets fit things like your sunglasses. Here we have the new AirPods. It fits that really nicely in there. And of course, my favorite, pens pencils, anything like that. It's got two slots for that all the way back here. Great. This also has our signature shallow pocket. I'm gonna put some of my business cards in there. Maybe a lip gloss from Beauty Pie. And those fit really easily. It's got the back magazine pocket that I always love on bags. Magazines are looking really slim right now because of the pandemic, so it fits in super easy. I also pulled out one of my favorite companies in town, Old Whaling Company, one of their soaps, because I think we're all taking a little more uh, cleaning supplies with us than we normally would. Well, that smells good. Um, the bottom has five of the brass studs, definitely with wear on them. And the other place this bag has quite a bit of wear is here on the main strap. It's not gonna tear, but there is certainly wear on here. And I will take closer pictures of that and put those in the eBay listings. This has all the brass details, all the originals, all the original studs, original zipper pulls on the back. They all say Alicia bags. Uh, this bag will be hard for me to let go of, but I hope someone out there loves it as much as I have. Have a great one. Bye.